In this video, we will see how to download the latest version of a firmware for Omicron CMC testsets and update it from the Omicron device link software application. There are two different methods that we can use it to know the latest version of firmware for Omicron CMC testsets. One is from the device link software. So the Omicron device link software install together when we install the test universe software application and the relation test software application. I have already associated the CMC test set uh, to my PC using the static IP address and there are other options uh, that we can also use it um, to configure the network setting for DHCP protocol support. There is another video you can able to um, see it in case if you are really interested. Um, so the basic option is we need to associate the CMC that we can also see already. I have associated and the device is ready to communicate with a different application. So here I can see by clicking the device, there is a new firmware uh, available. And I do see here uh, with the information icon um, by selecting the download firmware update, I can directly reach the Omicron customer portal um, directory. Um, this is the easiest option. And for this, we need an internet connection uh, in order to download the firmware um, from the Omicron customer portal. So this can be done on the different PC, and then you can also download it first and then copy in the flash drive. We can move it to the um, other PC in order to update in case if you're CMC in the, in the substation where you don't have a um, internet connection. So I select download option here and it takes me directly to the Omicron customer portal. So here I have already created the users. In case if you do not have a Omicron customer portal access, there is another video how you can able to um, sign up if you are a, a new user for Omicron um, and having the Omicron devices and then you can able to register with the Omicron device serial number and gain more access to get many different information. That is really helpful when you are working with Omicron test sets and in general to gain um, many information related to um, protection testing and primary application asset testing and substation automation system and cyber security applications. So let me log in here. And so this is the easiest option. In case if you would like to download um, without device link software support, you can go to the Omicron webpage. There is an option. You can select the login option. It will also take you to the Omicron customer portal by default. So I already logged in in another um, tab. That's why it automatically logged in. Otherwise, it will ask you uh, to provide the username and password details. So let us go to um, the first option. So it automatically takes me to the CMC test sets. And in case if you are logging in from the, the web browser and you see in the down um, left, this is a dashboard. And under the dashboard, you see many different sections and the recently released softwares and firmwares available under the software download category. So here I do see there is a firmware version available for the CMC test sets, which has been released um, 8th of August, um, 2022. So I can select here on the right arrow mark and it takes me to the same page, which we have reached directly from the Omicron device link software. So under this, I do see the firmware for different Omicron CMC test sets. So here I can see the firmware image for CMC 430 which is a portable solution and other solutions also easily portable, which is compact and, and you can also achieve many different applications like metering and protection and so many different application testing. And I do see here dedicated software uh, version for different test sets. And in my case, I have uh, CMC356. I do see from the device link software CMC356 and Net2 hardware option. So let's come back to the Omicron customer portal and my test set 
having the net2 hardware option and the firmware image which we need it for cmc356 in case if your cmc having the net1 hardware option um, this is the communication board that's available in the ray side of the cmc there you can able to see also device link uh, help you to know the the net1 and net2 hardware options so i need to download this um, net2 2.65.0005 version of the firmware so you can directly download in case if you are curious to know what are the new features um, that are part of the newer version of firmware please feel free to reach uh, omicron technical support uh, from the web page also from the customer portal area from the dashboard there you can see so this particular firmware having many different features um, and improvements so some of the api related um, Details has been included um, for the SIM engine application testing and then the secure web um, interface connections also improvements related to sample value time synchronization then the routable goes um, handling so let's come back to the so download folder so here I do see there is a firmware image downloaded into the default directly under the downloads folder so I can come back to the Omicron device link software application I can choose the second option update firmware that I can choose the image file so this goes by default to the default directory but we have downloaded the firmware under the downloads folder where we can pick then open and then there is an option in the down enables uh, having an option to select update so automatically um, it start um, proceeding further so update in progress which we do see now it takes few seconds only to update uh, the firmware over ethernet interface and usb also much faster than this and you have a direct connection so flashing in progress so the we do see also see update finished successfully and the device reboots automatically during the firmware update it's also important to have the the healthy connection without um, removing or plug out the cable the connection that you have from the Omicron device link software install PC to the to the test set are having the switch in between making sure and we do see here now the recent firmware that we updated so to that 65.0005 version has been updated before it was 2.64 version and now we have updated the firmware to the latest version so it's always recommended to update the firmware when we are working with CMC test sets um, to have the better performance and accurate test results for a different application requirements that we do have. And downloading the firmware is free of cost and updating the firmware is much easier that you see now. And in case if you find any difficulties, need any support, having more information related to the new firmware that you see you are always feel free to contact the omicron technical support under that support line category there you see the technical support emails that you can use it to request in case if you need any information related to the firmware or in case if you find some problem and we will be happier to support you with the right solution thank you take care bye